you know, her diagnosis came uh, kind of mid-2008, and she went immediately into chemo. Um, it had gone into remission for a year and then had come back. So and, and all of 2009, she was cancer-free. 2010, early 2010 in March uh, is when she got, uh, one of her checkups came back um, that the cancer had returned. And it was at that point, um, you know, I, re I remember getting that phone call from her and she was so devastated. And <clears throat> she was ready to give up right then. I, th I think the route of chemo for her was too cold in, uh, in its practice for, I, I think she felt less of a person in that, um, in that treatment. Um, and especially the way, you know, I remember her just so angry at, um, I, I think she got a, a voicemail from the doctor, you know, telling her that the cancer had come back. And I think that's what set her off on, on more of a homeopathic route because everything felt so factory you know, based the treatment with uh, going back to chemo. Um, and she didn't, I think for her, she didn't want to just be another percentage. Um, and it, it just didn't feel like she was getting answers.